Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Birdies with Bointy. Today we're on the putting green here at the Wilder Kent, a place that not a lot of people spend enough time on. Today we're going to be looking at a little bit of pace putting. Uh, I recently played in the Langley Park Pro-Am and the greens were absolutely fantastic. It took me a little while to get, get used to the speed of them and this is a drill that I wish I'd have used before I went out. So I'm just starting off about three foot away from the hole. I've made a semi-circle past the hole to an area that I'd like my balls to stop in. Why is, why is the semi-circle past the hole? 100% of putts that don't reach the hole don't go in. If the ball gets past the hole, at least it's had a chance to go in. And it's a semi-circle in that area because if it finishes within the semi-circle, I'm confident of making the next putt. So with pace putting, we're looking to get the ball as close to the hole from a distance. This sort of distance, we might be looking to hold the, ball, hold the first putt a lot more, but to begin with, I just want to look at the pace. If the ball goes in, I'm not too fussed about my line. I'm just trying to get feel and a, a touch on the greens. So I'm just going to hit four putts and try and get four balls into that semicircle. If they drop in like that, it's a bonus. As I say, I'm not too focused on the line. I just want them travelling at the speed that's past the hole. Even that one, I'm happy with the pace that I've hit that putt at. Maybe a bit pacier. It's just stayed in the circle. So, I'm happy with that. You might say to begin with, well, yeah, I can get the ball in from that distance, but by learning the speed of the greens from that distance, it enables us to just move another three foot further back, or maybe not be eight foot away now, and I'm just going to go and try and do the same thing. I'm just lengthening the stroke a little bit and looking to get that ball past the hole in the semicircle. If we'd have just started on this distance, we might not be getting all the balls straight in, but by starting on that closer distance and getting the speed from about three, four foot, it enables us to just move back and back. Again, happy with the pace. Mm, we might have liked that one a little bit harder. It just dropped in the front. Never criticise a putt that goes in. Then all of a sudden, I just, I'm happier with the pace. I haven't left myself much work to do with the second putts, and we're now back at this distance already. So just again, looking to lengthen the swing. Just stayed in. Happier with that pace. further back, try different holes, uphill, downhill, but just a good little tip. I've hit 12 putts, I'm quite happy with the speed of the greens, and now I'm happy to go out and play. If there's anything that you'd like me to look at in future lessons or future birdies with pointies, leave a comment below.